Welcome to Stuck in the Snow and Hungry, Part 2. What the f This morning we woke up and the ground was covered in snow. We were a little concerned about how we were going to get out. But as we started driving, we realized it wasn't that bad trying to get off this dirt road. So today we're going to continue our way to Washington in hopes of finding better weather. Our view slowly turned from winter wonderland to beautiful misty fall weather as we drove along the Columbia River Gorge and into our home for the night at Paradise Point State Park. We saw some beautiful rainbows, a lot of really gorgeous rivers, and even passed by Multnomah Falls, which is this gigantic waterfall on the side of the highway along Washington State. We're super excited to get to our next stop off for two reasons. One, we're gonna have hookups in the van for the first time ever, and we're gonna make a giant pot of smoky chili. And of course, a recipe to follow. All right, we have Next campsite. It's definitely the least remote we've been so far. There's a bunch of other campers, but look. Oh my god. We've got power hookups. And we have water. A picnic table and a fire pit. There's lots of other campers around, but that's all right. Look, do you see that? Our microwave is working. We're charging our stuff right now. We weren't really expecting this to be right on the highway, but it's pretty nice. Nice and comfortable. It's a good pit stop on our way to Olympic National Park. Huzzah. Anyway, we're just gonna rest here for the night, charge all our stuff, refill our water tank, and head out tomorrow morning going to Olympic National Park. We're gonna be staying at Soul Duck Hot Springs, which is inside the park, but it's kind of all the way to the very north. So the drive is gonna be a little bit longer. That's the update for today. We're just gonna make some chili for dinner, have an early night, maybe, probably not have a couple glasses of wine and kind of unwind a little bit and prepare for the long drive tomorrow. All right, what's on the menu for tonight? Chili. Chili. Step one, heat up your meat in a big pot this time. Once your meat is brown, you add your veggies. So when everything's nice and cooked, you add some beef bouillon and some water, stir it a bit, and then wait a little bit longer. I just gotta let it come to a boil to melt the bouillon cubes, and then we're gonna add tomatoes, tomato paste, um, and our chili seasoning that I just bought in a box because I'm feeling very tired and lazy. <laughs> but, <laughs> but it's a good box, I've used it before. So it'll be good. So a couple more minutes, and then we'll add the rest. Just a little chili spice mix. Mm. 
I'm going to do about half. Only half? Only half. Because this recipe is meant for a bigger, bigger batch. Two, two tablespoons. Two, two tablespoons. Tomato paste. Or it's like half a small six ounce can of three ounces. Roasted tomatoes with juice. It's a 10 ounce can. 10 ounce can. Chili powder? A little bit of, um, yeah, dried chili for spice because we like it hot. Uh. Well, the beans and more peppers, maybe 30 minutes before it's done. That's it. And while he is out there finishing up our chili, Making some rice over here. Boil it, put it down to a simmer. So, um, I'm just gonna put a half can of beans in and some fresh green peppers so it'll simmer for maybe. 30 minutes or so, and then dinner will be ready. Yay! Woohoo! Chili's done! We shoved a bunch of cheese slices on top, so it's it doesn't look very appetizing, but I can assure you that it's delicious. Carrie's just putting them away. And since we have hookup, huh. we have a heater! We got a mother heater! This thing's amazing. We lived by candlelight last night. So this thing is epic. We are gonna sweat our off tonight in a good way. In a good way. I think I made too much chili, you think? Is that too much chili? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, and we got our Netflix. And we got our back. Chili with a ton of cheese. That doesn't look very oh, good. I'm so excited. It's really smoky. It's really smoky. This is all done over campfire. <laughs> <laughs> we have power, lights, a movie, and chili, so it's, life's not all that bad right now. And Wine. Good Malbec. It's kind of hard to complain. Um. Look at these lights. This is amazing. We haven't had this in ever. <laughs> First time. So good. Is it really? Like I it? love it. Oh my gosh. You definitely downplayed it. It's amazing. It's really smoky, yeah. Yeah, I love it. It's spicy. Mm -hmm. oh this my is God. the first. You can see us because there's lights. Mm, Do you really like it that much? Chili and rice on a cold day. That wraps up our first night in Washington. Tomorrow we keep driving north. <laughs> <laughs> and we had to do an Olympic National Park in the hot springs. We're gonna stay at Salduk Hot Springs Resort. I have no idea. It's north. <laughs> <laughs> she asked me to go, why are you 
What? Well, why are you pointing up? Like that's north. I We're thought that was north. like. Wait, stop. You know, like. Whoop! One sec. Oh, okay. Anyway, we head further north tomorrow to Olympic National Park. Very excited. We have never been there, obviously, and it's gonna be a pretty long drive. So hopefully, it's a good drive. I will make sure to make some snacks this time. I'll give you something to snack on during the drive. Wow. Beef jerky. <gasps> Beef stick. <laughs> Beef stick. <laughs> and since we have full hookups there, we can reheat our chili and our rice. Yep, super stoked for that one. Yeah, very excited for that one. And we can use our heater. We will see you tomorrow bright and early when we start driving north. I thought you were going to point out. When we start driving north. <laughs> okay, bye. Good night. <laughs>